The jet lag is so bad and I look terrible, but the jet lag is so bad. Um, I'm currently eating watermelon and I have hummus and chips here, but I haven't e eaten those yet. Sorry, I got an email. I'm uploading the vlog for tomorrow. I have to wash my hair tomorrow. Like, what is this long piece doing here? I'm gonna have to sort that out. But that is basically, and I'm watching some Superwoman because I got all of my calendar done and I got all my binders done, which made me very, very happy because they're done way earlier in the semester than they typically are, but I got them done anyway. So that's exciting and now I'm just chilling. Tomorrow I have a day off, but I have to run, like I said in the last vlog, to a professor's office hours. So I will be down by the school, which kind of is annoying. But that is basically all I'm doing tonight. I'm so tired. I'm <laughs> like, my sleep schedule is still not back on track, but back on track. But I have to be at school by 9:30, and I still have to wash my hair and do makeup. So I have to at least be up by 6:30. But we will see. We will see. Hello. Oh my god. So I'm tired. Making my bed. It is 7.30. And I need to leave by 9.30. So I got some time. I gotta do makeup. As I still have makeup on from the night before. But I decided not to wash my hair. Although I probably needed to. But I didn't. Just making my bed. I'm gonna turn that light on. Um... Nothing really much is up. I'm so tired. I got up at 7 because I was like, oh, just I'm not going to set alarm. An alarm. And I didn't. I just woke up at 7. So at least my schedule is getting somewhat back on track. But not completely to where I wake up at 6. Regardless. But because waking up with an alarm is like something I absolutely hate. So absolutely hate it. But yeah. That's all that's going on. I have to run to campus, do something, and then come back and do work. So, I don't really know how entertaining it's going to be for you guys, but we'll, we'll try. I already have the vlog uploaded, which is nice, so I don't have to worry about that. I have edited and uploaded it last night, so. Go me. I'm getting better at this. <laughs> Ooh, weird shadow. Makeup is done. As you can see, I'm eating some type of cereal. I don't really have time to make anything, so that's what I have. It's like a gluten-free and vegan cereal thing i have a banana which is really tiny so i might have to eat another one but that is what i'm doing and i'm gonna sit and watch some youtube and then get ready to go because i need to leave at nine and it's currently 8 30 so that is what i need to do and yeah okay hello i have no idea what i vlogged today so <laughs> there's that also here we go. I look disgusting. My makeup has transferred, but today has been very productive. I went to school, had to deal with five million things because I, for whatever reason, I'm supposed to be able to log on to this website, um, like our main like thing for school, and apply for graduation. And um, for some weird reason, it's not available for me to do that. And I don't know if it's because I'm graduating early or what. And they can't tell me either. So I had to meet with someone. They told me that I have to go to my advisor, get all this paperwork done, and then take it back to the other advisor who happens to also be my thesis, thesis like, TED person. Like, they're not my thesis advisors, but they handle all the thesis stuff. So it doesn't matter because I have to make... I wanted to wait until... I talked to my two professors so that I have a date to defend it because it has to be done before December 1st. So I wanted to talk to them and figure out deadlines and stuff and they're all cool with them. So that is okay. And I can't do any homework because of my printer is apparently not working anymore. Like it's really weird. It used to be able, I used to be able to do it wirelessly, but I don't have a cable here and I had to order one because it's not working wirelessly, so I had to order a cable, which is fine. All good. <laughs> Ordered it, but it won't be here until won't be here until tomorrow. And I'm sweating, and I feel like I'm getting super sick. So I think I might run to Whole Foods. Probably. Well, what time is it? 
fix my I really need to go get like a wellness shot because I literally do not feel well at all and tomorrow as soon as I get up I really need to start doing reading but I can't print so I can print stuff I can email it to my printer which is so weird because it won't let me do all this stuff I don't know basically the Wi-Fi is working enough for me to be able to email things to my printer and print it, but doesn't print it double-sided. So, I can only print, like, I'm not, like, I have a 30-page, like, reading, and I'm not, uh, printing that single-sided. So, I have to wait until tomorrow. But I do have a 7-page one, so I might just print that and do that tomorrow morning. And I'm super, like, weird, I don't know, I, like, sat with my blanket. Again, I'm not feeling well. But, what I did want to show you is also this weekend because next weekend is labor day but i like i said i'm doing my thesis and i really need to get this graph done like coding this graph so that i can start writing the 30 pages although i technically have like about 10 that are done because i wrote it for a class last year last semester who, which happens to be one of my thesis advisor that i took he hopefully is gonna allow me i have to talk to him because yeah, they're all at a conference. All of my poli sci teachers at a conference next week, so I won't be able to meet with him next week. But I can meet with him the week after. But I need to talk to him about that whole situation, mainly because I actually am um, probably going to use the 10 page thing to apply for graduate school, which I'm going to talk about in December. So my first application is due December 1st for my first school and then December 14th and then like it's like January 14th and then like April and May but I'm gonna get them all done at once but I haven't even taken the GRE so that is a really big priority for me right now but I actually have like a shit ton of stuff so I wanted to show you what the state of my room looks like right now mainly because I feel like I was like well I have suitcases everywhere and this is literally true so I'm gonna turn you around so this is my desk area, which, whatever, just typical. All this stuff, that's medication, that's just camera shit. I have that, and then I have Gooby Gone. Then I have this, like, thing that I just store paperwork in. Then my printer is on that shelf, which obviously is not working. And then up there, I just have, like, random crap, which I think I'm getting rid of that right there. But everything else I'm keeping, I because that right there I got from my friend. And that, of course, is just everything. And then computer desk and then this is a hot train wreck there are dvds all the way down there but there's a suitcase and my backpack for school paper there's a yoga block under there a jewelry box which is not even filled because all my jewelry most of it is in this little suitcase right here i have a luggage scale assignment in there luggage you know things it's just a mess and then my vanity which also looks like a trash mess i had to go to sephora today to get my eyeliner that's the next mess that's just stuff from my bed this is a trash bag full of things that came out of my binder yesterday and then that's just shampoo and then i have this entire suitcase which i'm leaving because a lot of this is all sweaters and i also have shoes down there i have my gym shoes and then i have this bag which has a lot more stuff plus this has my lights and everything and all that so which I think on my main channel, I'm not going to be posting until January. So it'll be like six months off of that channel. But I kind of, I know exactly what I want to do with that channel. It's just, I don't have time to do that. And I might do one video a week, but we'll see how the semester goes along. Because obviously I don't have, like I showed you in the last vlog, I don't have as much stuff going on. Like as far as do, like stuff that's do, but I have a lot more just like independent stuff. So yeah, but I wanted to show you my room because it's like a mess, but honestly, I'm just going to live with it and I'm normally not the type of person that can deal with that kind of stuff. I don't like living out of suitcases, but to be honest, it doesn't really make sense to unpack right now. And I know it sounds crazy. Oh, I'm leaving in like four months, but like realistically, that four months is going to go very quickly and I have a lot of stuff going on and I have stuff I have to go through. Like my closet, kid you not, kid you not, is... A mess like I don't even know if you guys can see this but this is what my closet look like like all that stuff back there is just stuff old binders I'm not using this is all my extra makeup stuff which I don't think actually has anything in it like 
it's a mess in here. So, plus all that stuff back there, like, there's a lot of stuff that has to be cleaned in this place. And as much as I, which is partially the reason why I'm not pat unpacking, is because there is so much stuff and it's going to have to go somewhere. And these suitcases, I know we're not going to be going into it. Most of my stuff, my parents are bringing suitcases with them. And that's where all that stuff will go. There are a few things that I'm not taking. Like I've said in the past, I'm not taking those two things. Like the, this, boop, that, and that. I mean, obviously I'm taking everything in them, but yeah. It's just going to be a mess. But we will, we were going to roll with it. Okay, so I'm home. I took my makeup off. And I'm in a sweater. Because... Hashtag no pants. Um, <laughs> this sweater is huge, so it's all good. But this is what I do when I get sick. Can you use the camera to focus? I take these because, for whatever reason, they help. It is raw organic ginger juice, raw organic lemon juice, raw organic coconut juice, and organic cayenne pepper. So if I am sick, it's pretty much fixes it especially whenever i first get sick but i try taking them before because i really don't want to be getting sick struggle is real i don't really want to be here i feel like here's the thing i'll be in waves where i'll be like okay like getting ish done and like i'm here to graduate and blah blah blah, blah. and then there are times like i think at night where i'm just like this is also why i don't watch a lot of like vloggers while i'm here because as much as i love like lily singh and i used to love shep 689 but they don't vlog they don't daily vlog anymore it can be really tough because i can be in moods where i'm like really you know excited and i'm like all right i'm here for this reason and this reason because i go to an amazing school but it's not always easy i think with anybody who is not living in the place that their family is i, I mean not, not everybody but i feel like majority it's, it's hard so <sighs> that's the struggle and i think at night it just gets really hard um we're just going with the flow and hopefully i'm not gonna get sick because i don't have time to be sick it's a little very hot in here i also not feeling so hot like i said so um i'm just like not having any of it like there's no part of me that's having it today so that is basically <laughs> all that's going on i have no idea what i'm gonna be buying tomorrow because i'm not planning on going anywhere because i have a list of about five million things to do so i will we'll figure it out i might go somewhere i might not but literally when i went to whole foods there were so many people there and i was just not having any of it either like i'm just like not in the mood to be social so that is basically life i'm like really still sunburnt but yeah i'm watching lily sing while well, i'm her vlog channel I need to take everything down off that. I feel like I was telling my mom, so I'm like, there's so much stuff here. So much stuff. But it's okay. We'll figure it out, guys. And you'll be here on the journey with me. Okay, so I washed my hair and straightened it. It's to here. I know I'm wearing black, but it's to there. I thought it was a little bit longer than that, but whatever. Because I she curled it, which is fine. I, it needed to be cut, so I didn't really care. But I have to run to Target. Yet again, because I have no post-its. Well, that's a lie. I have post-its, but I only have ones that are like this. Can you see that? And I can't put that in the front of this because that would be kind of a mess. Also, that planner, I cannot wait to get a new one because I can't put anything YouTube-related in there because there's not enough space. So, looking forward to that, but I need to run to Target. I'm also probably going to get coffee because I've been living on caffeine. Well, most cat or like coffee because i don't drink anything other um caffeine because i'm so tired i'm not putting makeup on because i have to be here and read all day long and this is like the shortest one but i do need to read that because i have two other things one of them is 30 pages and one of them is 22 and I haven't printed them yet because my printer is a long story and I've already kind of explained it so I have to wait until I get that thing today. Also I'm supposed to be getting some stuff that I can put on my laptop because I have like a whole bunch of stickers on my laptop but I'll show you when I'm done because I don't want to like show you part way through and yeah my hair is super soft which is super nice. Um, like this is like the longest blonde piece I have. Everything else like if you look it's like here. <laughs> 
I'm like, cool. Um, but I'm going to dye it red because it's almost, the blue is almost out. Because, of, yeah. <sighs> Which I probably should be washing it more frequently if I wanted to get it out. But I really don't care enough, so. That is what's going on. I'm going to run to Target and come back and then work on shit all day long. And then edit this video. Because it has to go up tomorrow. So, yeah. That's my, my thrills. Okay, so I got back from Target a while ago. I have an email from someone. Oh, no, I don't. Okay. Um, I got everything I needed. I picked up post-its. I got a whole block of them and then just took one color off and put it in my planner. I taped it. I'm about to write the post-it of what homework I need to do because that's just the way I roll. <laughs> like this is what I do this is yeah apparently I have to-do lists this is more like what it would normally be like that so and I discovered that this is the pen I use for this and also crossing things off of my like calendar like whenever I turn them in and this is my last one here. So hopefully I can keep this the entire semester. Because if I don't, I'm going to have to buy new ones. Or a new one. Because this is... I don't know what it is. It's like I have to have this pen. Because I don't write in pen very often. I write in pencil most of the time. So... Yeah. That's basically what's going on. I'm writing down my homework. I don't have too much, to be honest. I just have a lot of reading that I can't really do until I have a... Until I have a printer. Um, my hair is all sorts of crazy. I bought red hair dye. So I can dye it. Because it's pretty much faded at this point. So I need to get that shit taken care of. Although I will say my hair is not as thin at the bottom anymore. Because I had ombre hair for a long time. With like blonde. And then I dyed. I like highlighted it blonde. So like probably what they just cut out of it. Was the rest of the blonde plus the ombre. So this isn't as bad. It's not as dead. But it's still. I'm still letting it grow out. It'll probably be a couple years before I actually end up dying. Because I think I'm going to leave it natural for a while. And also when I'm home. My hair is already getting dark. But because of the sun and stuff. My hair actually gets like bleached and stuff. From the sun. Which I know is terrible. You should really not be getting that much sun damage on your hair. But whatever. So I had an argument with both my suitcases today. As you can see. There's crap everywhere. It's because I was looking for a bra that I couldn't find. But I found it. It's not the one I'm wearing, but I actually found it. So I guess there's that. <laughs> okay. I don't even know what the last thing I vlogged was, to be honest. I am sitting at my desk. I did do a reading. One of them. I still have two more to go. And I got stickers for my laptop. Finally, let me move my water bottle so y'all can actually see it. But this is what it looks like now. So... Yay, go me. I'm like in love with it. Um, because I got all my stickers. A lot of these are from Red Bubble. Am I saying that right? Some of them are from Pride. One of them is from Kamala Harris, who is the senator from California. And then the other three I just got when I was in Santa Monica. So, if you're wondering, that's where I got them all. Five million things of paperwork and. My phone is turned off, so if anyone's trying to reach me, they can't. Mainly because I'm about to, like, fall asleep. I'm so tired. Uh, this is literally my life right now. The jet lag is so bad, and I look terrible, but the jet lag is so bad. Which you wouldn't think it would be, but whatever. Also, my hair is, like, turning green now. So it's definitely time to dye it. Because, uh, I can't. I can't with the green. Um, literally that's about it. I'm gonna try to edit this tonight. But we'll see if that happens. Maybe not have to edit it in the morning when I get up. Which hopefully will not be at, like, 8.30. Like, it has been. So. There's that. So much fun, guys. So much fun. Not really. 